Hey guys, welcome to What the Tech Wednesday, where every Wednesday I'm going to bring you a tip of the week for command or another piece of Keller Williams technology that will help you with your business. So today I'm going to show you uh, call forwarding for Twilio. It's a new feature that just released. I'm excited about it because um, when I have done classes on smart plans and we have talked about Twilio, one of the concerns that I've heard from agents is that what happens when someone tries to call my Twilio number? Because when you sign up for Twilio, you are able to have your smart plans text people in your database. So texting new leads that come in from a Facebook ad, things like that. Um, and it's not coming from your personal cell phone number. It is a local Twilio number that you sign up for. However, I've had people say, what happens when someone tries to call it? Uh, so we tested it out in the class and you know it didn't ring, it didn't do anything. Of course, it couldn't come to your phone. So what they've set up now is call forwarding, where if someone tries to call your Twilio number, it will ring to your personal cell phone number. So how you set that up is in command, you're gonna go in the top right and click your name. Then you're gonna click settings. When this loads, you're gonna scroll down. Look for Twilio. And you'll see here that I've got a little error that says you have no call forwarding number assigned to this account. Click manage to set up call forwarding. So over on the right, I'm gonna click manage. This is gonna show me here like my account usage. So it'll show you how many text messages you have available or how many credits you have available um, for the remainder of the month. And at the bottom, it's gonna show you how many credits will be used anytime the call forwarding is used. So it, it, it uses six credits initially to set it up. And then if it is, um, a, you know, a US number, so a plus one country code, it will be three credits a minute and other country codes are five credits a minute. And then if you have to change your call forwarding at any time, it will use um, the six credits again if you have to change it. So essentially, um, it could drain your credits pretty quickly if you're talking to them all the time on it. Um, so keep that in mind, however, this will be great, especially if you're mainly using your Twilio um, you know, number for texting on smart plans for new leads and things like that, where a lot of time it takes a lot of messages to finally get them to reply. So if they try to call you on that, you know that at least that number will come through to you. And then of course, if you missed the call and you called them back, that would come from your personal cell phone number. So to set it up, all you'll do is click on set up call forwarding, so here you're going to type in your number and then it's just going to review everything we just talked about and I'm going to click this checkbox for I've read it and accept the cost for call forwarding that's just this part right here and then you're going to click assign number it's going to text you a verification code so you'll have to check your phone for that so I just got mine so I'm going to type it in and if it doesn't come you have an option to resend it here So I'll click verify number and then it's connected. So now if someone tried to um, call that Twilio number, they'd received a text message from me, it would forward that to my cell phone. So if you guys have any questions while you are setting that up, run into any issues, let me know. If not, I will see you guys next Wednesday for our next video.